Hello, everyone. This is Barb with Mystic Door Tarot, and thank you so much for joining me. This is your daily tarot card reading for Sunday, May 19th, 2024. Today we have the King of Swords. Let's bring this in. All right. Well, we have the King of Swords energy coming in today. And in the Mystical Moments deck, we are looking at the female King of Swords. As in this deck, there are two kings for each suit. So instead of the sword, the female King of Swords is holding a large needle up to the sky. And the needle is so sharp that the king can pluck the shining stars from the universe and sew them onto her sparkling dress. The king's crown demonstrates that she possesses stellar gifts of intellectual power and mental clarity, and she has the authority that compels people to listen to her, and she can see the truth in all matters. There's no fooling the king of swords. Now, the stars symbolize the infinite knowledge that exists in the universe. So today, with this energy, this is being very insightful. This is being a problem solver, possibly a quick learner, quick study. You could certainly be adapting the traits of the King of Swords, which is making choices based on a strong moral compass, maybe approaching situations with discipline and self-control. This is someone who embodies the qualities of intelligence, fairness, and clear communication upholding principles of justice and integrity. You could be demonstrating clear, decisive leadership today, maybe applying strategic thinking to solve complex problems. Now, the King of Swords is a natural leader, able to inspire and guide others with the clarity of thought and conviction. So with this card turning up today, it is an invitation to think critically and communicate clearly to stand up for what is right and just. And this may mean making difficult or unpopular choices or taking a firm stand on a controversial issue. So the King of Swords encourages us to use our intellect and communication skills to uphold truth and justice. And this is Aquarius's card in energy. And right now, Pluto is retrograde in Aquarius, moving for a final dip back into Capricorn to finish things up before moving forward in November permanently for the next 20 years in Aquarius. So you could be adapting some of the traits of the fixed air sign Aquarius, bringing innovation and individuality to situations, promoting originality. You could be involved in humanitarian efforts, very much progressive thinking as Aquarius encourage really encourages thinking outside the box, contributing to a better future. So this energy is kind of all around us right now in general, as well as we might be adapting some of the traits of the King of Swords. And all the stars on this gown is the hope, threading the hope for the future, seeing things with clarity and courage and standing up for what's right. Now, the crystal that is specifically associated with the King of Swords is gold, which is associated with many spiritual meanings. Gold is linked to prosperity and wealth because it's often called the metal of the sun because of its association with sunlight. In many cultures, gold symbolizes spiritual growth, transformation, and renewal. And interesting, gold's immunity from rust gives it connotations of immortality and incorruptibility. And that kind of ties into the Aquarian energy and the energy that we're heading towards come November. Now, gold is associated with generosity, compassion, fertility, the tree of life. And in ancient Egypt, people believed gold had magical powers and would bury their dead with gold to protect them in the afterlife. So gold's spiritual significance is rooted very deep in its association with the divine and the life-giving properties of the sun. So pull out your gold jewelry today, especially if you're in some uh, like need of clarity in regard to a situation, a circumstance, as there's no fooling this energy that's affiliated with the King of Swords. 
And you just might have that aha moment today that would either help you solve a problem or getting the clarity to now be able to move forward, especially in regards to helping and inspiring others. Well, that's the energy for today. Thank you so much for joining me. Love and abundance. Until tomorrow.